Skies and warmer temperatures mean it's perfect time to talk about boating safety. Local 3's Audrey Pentecost has more. Get ready to sail into National Safe Boating Week. The United States Coast Guard and the National Weather Service are using this week to remind everyone about safe boating practices as boating season begins. So wearing a life jacket, educating yourself and kind of going through um, skill based training, wearing your engine cutoff switch, abstaining from use of alcohol is a really big one, uh, registering like your beacons um, and then potentially getting a free safety vessel inspection for uh, from the auxiliary. Make sure you have a life jacket that is U.S. Coast Guard approved that fits you correctly and is not damaged. Weather can change in an instant on the Great Lakes, so the National Weather Service wants to remind everyone to check the forecast before they head out. The National Weather Service, we do issue special forecasts for uh, people who are heading out onto the lake. We actually have multiple tiers to those forecasts for folks who just want to recreate and stay near shore. And then if folks want to traverse all the way across Lake Superior, we actually have a forecast uh, for folks out there. So simply using a, a weather app, going to weather.gov and clicking here on the UP and they have access to the, uh, the marine forecast that we're issuing from our office and also making sure folks who are out there uh, have marine radio and things like that so when warnings are being broadcast they're hearing um, the threatening weather that's moving towards them. The National Weather Service also wants to remind you that even if the temperature is hot on land the lake is much colder. Hypothermia can set in quickly in Lake Superior's frigid conditions so make sure you're cautious throughout the summer. Make sure to stay safe on the water this year. Reporting in Marquette, Audrey Pentecost, Local 3 News.